Top 10 Secrets About Female Robots When it comes to the field of robotics, the technology used behind this field has developed and upgraded a lot since the time it was first announced. With the world advancing towards a future with more advanced robots, these robots are also being made and beautifully designed in such a manner that they seem extremely close to a human being. With technologies like artificial intelligence and machine learning enabling these robots with more human-like functionalities, these upcoming robots are just awesome. But there must be something odd to such a positive thing, right? Every flourishing career must have had some darker side to it. How did we actually come up with such ideas? Well, in order to know that, watch the video till the end to know more. The world is advancing day by day, and with it, the field of robotics and IoT have also been moving towards its future. With robots that can not only do menial tasks, but now it can also speak, interact, and automate almost all of our jobs, thus the idea of robots, which was quite incomprehensible in the earlier times, is now possible. However, there have been claims of a number of secrets that have not come up in the news or are well known by a number of people. But we've got you covered. We have curated a list of the top secrets about these female robots. So without any further ado, let's just dive into it. Beginning with the number one fear of people, we have the rise of robots as its own species. The main reason behind developing humanoid robots and mega-humans was to enable them to do tasks in order to accomplish repetitive tasks in place of humans. But the technology has now become so advanced that robots are now capable of doing some tasks that are quite incomprehensible, with human-like intelligence and in some ways better than humans. Thus, people fear that there might come a day when robots would automate every human task, thereby making people lose jobs and cause unemployment. It has been estimated that the robots can emerge as their own species by the year 2040, as per the claims made by the creator and founder of Carnegie Mellon's Robotics Institute. Robots will very soon replace humans for manual work and tasks. Therefore, the thing which people were quite afraid of might actually be true someday. However, the topic is still debatable. Number two, a number of people have claimed that robots would be the doom of the world. But this does not sound much different from the rise of the robots fact, right? Well, apparently this is different. A bunch of people recently have made claims in various interviews that robots, especially humanoid robots, have the capability of having destructive thoughts. And these robots may want to either destroy or dominate humans. While there might be possibilities of such dangerous and heinous acts, since we have already seen movies like The Terminator, but the thing is, possibilities are endless. And in future, if for some reason a robot outbreak happens, then I believe in the future there might also be technologies that can put an end to it. But that's just a wild guess. However, constantly developing technologies might put humans at risk. Moving on to number three, robots can read your mind. Yes, you heard that right. Technology has now become so advanced that people have now come up with robots that can easily read up your mind. A thing that even humans are incapable of. Scary, isn't it? The latest methodology has been developed in this field that can create an image of your thoughts using an fMRI scanner. Such robots are designed to construct an image from your brain and compare it with other pictures received from volunteers. Number 4. Most of the humanoid robots that have been developed as of now are female. Starting from Nadine to Sophia to Junko Chihira, you will most likely find most of these humanoid robots to be female. But why is it so? It is mostly because women are perceived to be kinder, warmer, and more likely to experience emotions than men. The female gendering of artificially intelligent objects contributes to humanizing them. And, as it seems, warmth and experience are most definitely seen as a fundamental qualities to be a full human, but are lacking in machines. Number 5. Robots are now so advanced and human-like that they have their own nationalities and passports. Yes, a robot that goes by the name of Sophia has been granted the citizenship of Saudi Arabia. You might have heard about this robot in our earlier videos. However, this fact was brought down by a lot of controversy, as it made the public wonder and question whether or not robots should be given such rights. The real goal behind artificial intelligence is for humans to have a machine that thinks faster and more efficiently, and not to replace humans completely. Moving on, number 6. People claim that robots will be the reason behind unemployment and poverty in the near future. 
While these claims may be true to some level, the robotic revolution has been claimed to not take everyone's jobs. However, automation might be taking up some of them, especially in the areas of manufacturing and industry. However, it is just making the work different. Apparently, a machine might not eliminate a position or a person's job, but in turn, it may convert an average skilled job into a low skilled job, thereby lowering the pay with it. Number 7. The proper term for a female humanoid robot is gynoid. Yes, you might think of them as androids, or some other fancy word that you may have come across, but as it seems, the term android only refers to a male-looking robot. In contrast to this, the proper term for a female human-like robot is gynoid, where they appear widely in science fiction, film, and art. Number 8. Most of the robots that have been developed until now are genderless. Yes, you really heard that right. Technically, robots are genderless, but it is only the voices given to each one of that categorizes them as male or female. And yes, most computerized robot voices tend to be female. One such reason behind this is that females are traditionally lovely, warm, kind, and caretaking. Number 9. The robot that goes by the name of Sophia, who has been granted the citizenship of Saudi Arabia, has more rights than any other woman in Saudi Arabia. But apart from that, she has been invited to a number of TV shows, like The Tonight Show and other numerous conferences around the world, including the World Economic Forum and the AI for Good Global Summit. And as a matter of fact, Sophia has also sung the song All Is Made Of Love at the GIMC 2016 held at Beijing. Number 10. Female robots have now become so advanced that they are being used in a number of industries as an employee. Erika, a female humanoid robot, currently has been working as a news anchor. Created by Hiroshi Ishiguro from the Intelligent Robotics Laboratory, Erika is one of the most intelligent humanoid robots developed in Japan. She also has built-in face recognition technology and speech generating algorithms built in to track different faces in a room and also allow her to make various facial expressions accordingly, with special emphasis being given on her verbal capabilities while being developed. It seems Japan has done a great job. The developer thinks that the robot might have a real soul, but this seems quite debatable and also incomprehensible. Another such robot is Junko Chihira, a humanoid robot working in a shopping center on Tokyo's waterfront, who has been answering all of the local tourists' questions for a while now. Developed by Toshiba, using the technology created by Hiroshi Ishiguro, who also created Erika, the local tour guide is embedded with speech synthesis technology, machine learning, and natural language processing, which enable her to comprehend, process the information, and make accurate answers to the tourist questions. It is also programmed to make sign languages, thus helping the hearing-impaired tourists. And that's the end of this list. Do you think robots will take over people's jobs someday in the near future? Can the rise of the robots be a thing of concern for us as human beings? Should we be afraid of these robots? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. We would love to hear your thoughts on this while we keep working on making more such videos. Well, that brings us to the end of this video. We hope you have enjoyed watching the video. Please like the video if you have not already and make sure to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to press the bell icon to never miss another update from our channel. With that being said, let's meet in another one of these videos. Until then, see ya.